Hey Hippo, uh, I basically use the item duplication glitch for money, rather than completely breaking stats. And that was just to save time more than anything else. But now that we are in the in the Gullwing, we can basically cover a lot of ground we could not before, including going to these various islands. Now before I before I continue on with where or the game wants us to go, there is an optional dungeon that's open to us now. I'll be flying to that shortly. But before that, I want to showcase something really quick. Okay, it's further south. Oh, I did not mean to land. <laughs> so down around here, just east of the arena, Okay, a little further south. So, uh, one of the islands here, the one without a beach. Actually, no, I think... Okay, they all have beaches. So, I, I was wrong then. You can come here much earlier, but on one of these islands, there is a fairly... I'd say uncommon, not necessarily rare enemy, called uh, Kyokotolon. So something like that. It's really weird. It's kind of an alien-like creature that uses human experimentation, which uh, makes full, which makes uh, equipping full levers necessary against them. But those are the only enemies in the game you can steal duplicators from. So it's just best to go in there, uh, use Trickster to steal them, and that's what you need to do in order to get a decent amount of duplicators, unless of course you are like me and using the item duplication trick. So what we need to do is that hidden dungeon is near the abbey. Once we once we upgrade the proto wing to the full fledged goal wing, it becomes a lot easier to see things on the map. In fact, it's right here. Excellent. So welcome to Heaven's Corridor. And of course, to come in here, we need a duplicator. This is the Heaven's Corridor, a tower of gifts to those who want to attain higher magic than the Mage D. And this dungeon has a very, very annoying gimmick that I am very likely going to run into more than once. But for now, just use the airdrop to get inside. Of course, we jump off the ledge there to get back down to the bottom. Basically, watch your step. There are tiles that send you back to the start of the dungeon. And they're all hidden. Most of them are just uh, straight on the way, but I'm going to try and avoid them. Magic Carrot. A lot of these are probably just Carrots and Press Graphs. What do we got here? A battle. <laughs> And, yep, uh, really, just enemies back from the Demon Gate. In fact, I'm just gonna try and run. Actually, I have not yet messed with that fast draw. I mean, we're several levels higher than we were. Why are these guys giving us trouble? Oh, we got it. So, oh, Phaser Zap! It hits all enemies with all seven elements. Or just one enemy with all seven elements, yeah. <laughs> and we can probably finish with regular attack. And since we did go to the L of Dimension, the music probably sounds a little bit a little bit more echoey. It's mostly notable in this dungeon and the battle theme. For the duplicator. And hey, Crest Grass. Who's surprised? But that's one reason why I came here, because the next dungeon in the main story does not have the does not have this music. Alright, prisoner. Well actually you can kill these guys with guilty blade.
to be an inheritor wizard if you want to read it. Why do you seek higher magic? If you want to bring light to the world, then go to the hidden nature of the obscured place. There, the innocent must cast his light. So, there's our hint to get through that door. Doors are shut. Wait, what? That's the. Uh... Yep, let's take a moment and probably kill these guys. Get all that to attack enemy. Oh, I goofed. It's not a teardrop door, there's a switch in the other room. Back at it! <laughs> I feel kinda silly now. I wonder. Nope, nothing on nothing on radar. There's a there's a hidden switch. Nope. Alright, door is open. Pandemonium, do you want to read it? There's an ancient demon castle located in the east end of the inner sea. The smell of a thousand year old evil still lingers in the desolate isle. Magic of the war. Oh, do you want to read it? You can ward off unwanted guests by using magic and send them back to the entrance. If you seek higher magic, you should undo those warding gates. Yeah, there's our warning. Warning of the warding. So basically, hey, free treasure chest. Yeah, send hand pan to get it because that's where the first warding gate is. Another one. Why do they have to be grouped together? Here, yet another duplicator door, so come in here with at least three. Yep. I obvious trap there. Okay, yeah, I've got to Got gotta walk carefully along here. These things are normally in the in, in the direct line of the of the path. So thankfully the save point is here. I have uh, copious notes for this one. So we got another one right here. And yeah, I think the next one there. Oh, new enemy. So the gnome. Nope, you know what? Let's just uh, blast him with Cecilia. I sent Kitten around. Bye-bye. Yeah, she's dancing. <laughs> yeah, she's uh, become quite uh, quite powerful, and I don't I don't blame her for just enjoying blowing enemies away like that. Okay, so
Okay, I do think we passed most of the warding gates. So what we got here is just a puzzle where you have to catch the diamond. And really, it's just trial and error. I never really found a good way to do this. Just try and get it caught right here. Just have to kind of manipulate it into a different spot. There we go. Alright, uh, make sure there are no... Wards here. Okay, this one's definitely the hardest, but kind of get that there. There we go. Just a matter of learning, learning. It. Luring it into a corner. But fortunately that should be the that should be it. So that that puzzle was for right here. Finally! My successor has arrived! Many trials have proven your worth. You shall receive the arts of the ultimate sorcery! I must warn you. Do not drown yourself in this power, for the essence of sorcery is not the size or effect of a spell, but in the utilization of wisdom. You must purify your magic through wisdom, my successor. You shall master the elements through purity and execution. And with that, we learn the dual cast force. So Cecilia no, it has all four of hers. And for the hell of it, let's just show let's just show off one of those wardings. I thought was, I thought there was one more at the top, in case people got thrown off. Now, no, we gotta go back through the puzzle rooms here. And... Okay, not quite right there, but... Maybe one... It's right in the middle... Here? No? Okay, there it is. Okay, hey, I, they have a smaller hitbox than I remember. But, thanks for sending us back at MageD. Yep, we're out of here! Alright, with that done, let's take a trip back to Edelheed and just uh, top off really quick. Yep, even though we can fly, still better to uh, teleport. Actually, I just realized something. There's. Uh, I think there's one more rune we can get up in the north spot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna double check. May not be able to get until after we can upgrade the, the proto wing. Where are we? I think it's on the north, north end of the map. On the plus side, we do get to enjoy this music. Ah, oh. oh, we can't fly over those mountains. Cage Tower. Yeah, nothing else we can do here. Okay, I think what we need, yeah, I think we do have to be able to get over the mountains. In any case, we need to go to Court Sam, so I might as well just rest up and top things off in there. And. 
Oh, there's, there's the next dungeon. <laughs> There we go. Good, you're here. Nope, oh, easy peasy. Yeah, you call it a gorgeous evening, I know. Oh, I know, I mean, or otherwise. Alright, well, we got a sneak preview. Let's actually head to the place now.